Hi, today we're going to read about the big snow. Mom, said David, when will it snow? I think soon, said Mom. Why don't you help make cookies while you wait? So David helped Mom make cookies. He took the sugar and raisins and flour from the cupboard. He measured out two cups of sugar. He measured one cup of raisins. But then the flour, white and fine, made David think of snow. So he decided to check the weather. Small flakes fell softly white and fine. Mom said, David, do you think it will snow taller than the grass? I think so, said Mom. Why don't you help clean the bathrooms while you wait to find out? So David helped Mom clean. He put on big yellow gloves. He sprayed the cleaner. He scrubbed with the heavy brush. But then the, st the suds, white and fluffy, made him think of snow. So David decided to check the weather. The flakes were lying white and fluffy. But then the new sheets, white and cool, made him think of snow. So David decided to check the weather. The snow was covering everything white and cool. Mom, said David, it's going to be a big snow. It just might, said Mom. Why don't you finish eating lunch and then take a nap while you wait to find out? So David took his blanket and pillow from his bed. The, he curled up in the big armchair. He closed his eyes and began to dream, and he dreamt. That is when very, that is what, that it was a very big snow, that the snow fell heavily. The wild wind pushed flakes through window cracks, that it howled and shook the walls, that it roared and blew open all the doors and piled drifts around the house. Mom, called David, is this big snow? Yes, yelled Mom. Help me clean up this huge mess. So David helped Mom clean up the snow. He tried to push the door shut, but the drifts were too deep. He tried to shovel away the drifts, but the snow just fell heavier. Suddenly, loud thumping shook the house. David woke up. There was stomping at the door. It was Dad, home from work early. Dad, said David, is it very big snow? Why don't you come find out for yourself? So David and Mom put on their winter coats. They wrapped a long, long scarves around their necks. They pulled up warm hats and gloves. The End